Hello everyone, welcome back to High Mathematics. Today we have an interesting integral. We have integral of 2x plus 10 to the power 100 dx. On the first side, this integral is real hard because we have one, 100 power right here. So this is this will be a huge, huge expression if rated. But we don't need to rate it. I want to show you a real good method how to how to solve it. Take a look how we solve it easily and in in two minutes, I guess. So first of all, we can write this 2x plus 10 will be our our t. So this expression will be our t in this parenthesis. This will be our t. And when this is our t, we need to find a substitution with this dx. So finding derivative from both sides, 2dx equal to dt. And if we divide in both parts by 2, we will have the dx equal to dt over 2. So we have all all substitution elements. So let's put all of these elements in our in our integral. How does this integral looks like? Looks like that integral of t to the power 100 because 2, 2x plus 10 equal to t and dx equal to dt over 2 times dt over over 2. So first of all we have a constant right here so we can factor out this right here. We will have one half integral t to the power 100 dt. And how can you integrate this? Of course easily without any any trouble. So first of all we need to add 1 and to divide in by this. We have to look like x square x cubed divided by 3. But instead of x we have t. So we can write it as 1 half and 1 over 101. This is a constant. This is our integra integration step. And times t to the power 101 and plus c and when we multiply all of this we will have a constant 1 dividing by 202 and t to the power 101 and plus c so this is our integral we find it but we work with t and we need to find substitution so t equal to x plus 10 and right here we have over t so our final answer will be 1 dividing by 202 and in parentheses we will have 2x plus 10 to the power 101 and plus c so this will be our will be our integral as you can see there is no like a long expression right here we find easily this solution and we right here we have power 100 so this is our solution. Of course, if you know a lot about derivative, you can find derivative from this. And if you find it, you need to have this answer. So if you find derivative from this, you need to have this answer. If you find in derivative, you will have 101 right here and right here power 100. So this is good. And this constant we can cancel. So if you're interested in this, find derivative and write your answer with this derivative in a comment and we will check our answer. So if you still have any question, write a question in a comment, write your suggestion in a comment. Thank you for watching and see you in the next videos.